A, a lot of the um, arguments we've heard at some of these school board meetings have been fueled by misinformation. And our reporter Marcelino Benito was up there for the Conroe board meeting last night. He heard from a grandmother who spoke out against the mask mandate. And I want to kind of go rapid fire with you through some of the claims that she made. Uh, just let me know if they're true or false or and if you want to expand on that, you can. But I'm going to dive right in. So her first claim. These vaccinations are poison. Kids are dying because of the vaccine. Absolutely false. Masks do more harm to kids than catching COVID-19. Masks limit oxygen levels by making it hard for kids to concentrate. Kids develop diseases due to wearing masks, also ammonia, and can lead to lung infections in kids. This has been well studied. That's absolutely false. Masks don't protect you from catching COVID. That is false. Child hospitalizations are rising because of adverse effects with vaccine, not because they're catching COVID. That is false. It's the opposite is true. More people have died from the COVID vaccine than COVID-19. Absolutely false. If you take hydroxychloroquine, ivermentin, and zinc, you can beat COVID. False. Your immune system is 99.9% .9 able to beat COVID and it's the vaccine that lowers our immunity. False. You can sleep next to someone with COVID-19 and not catch it. You can, but I wouldn't do it. <laughs> People have a 99% chance of surviving COVID. Uh... So, you know, uh, what we're seeing is that you got about, what we're seeing is that if you've been exposed to COVID and you've contracted, you got about a one in 50 chance of being hospitalized, and then you got a one in 10 chance of dying. So I would say, uh, 99, I'd say that's false. 